Hello YouTube, my name is uh, Jeffrey and uh, today I'm uh, going to fly with the Delta Glider 4 to the moon and uh, land on the spaceport called uh, Brighton Beach. So uh, this will be, I think, uh, uh, yeah, part one, uh, part one of uh, of three. I think that I'll need uh, three videos, short videos, to uh, yeah transfer from here, We're, uh, from planet Earth uh, to the moon and land on uh, Brighton Beach. So we are currently in an orbit with planet Earth. Um, as you can see, uh, we are flying uh, 381.3 kilometers above the surface of the Earth. Yeah, well, we are in a decent uh, orbit, I think. So let's get started with, uh, yeah, to get in uh, the same orbit path as the moon so uh, therefore we are going to need the aligned plane MFD so please uh, select on the left MFD the aligned planes and uh, target the moon and um, yeah, as you can see we are we already have a very low relative inclination of 3.2 31 degrees and that is saying something about uh, yeah, the, the matches between our orbit path and the orbit path of the moon so we are nearly uh, our descending node and uh, I hope that you have watched my uh, other tutorial about how to bring an, uh, sp uh, a space uh, plane uh, Delta Glider for uh, rendezvous and uh, dock uh, with the International Space Station and uh, I hope that you've seen it because there I'll sh yeah, go a little bit deeper in when to burn at a certain point when you are uh, reaching your descending node and uh, which button you will going to need so that being said uh, we are going to descending node and it is normal plus mode so let's get started uh, with uh, that and also go to normal speed and as you can immediately see our uh, yeah, plane is uh, rotating to go to the right position so on the left uh, MFD the computer system will tell us when we will uh, should hit our main engines at full throttle and this value TN uh, is stating that we are 28 seconds away from our descent so we are going to start burning before that so let's get ready because it will uh, give the message shortly there we have it so I'm using the plus sign on my numpad to uh, yeah, go full throttle at once with the main engines and now we have to keep an eye on uh, the relative inflammation because we would like to have that uh, get close uh, to zero uh, as possible. Very bad English, I'm sorry. Alright, and let translation find you. So what we're going to do now is go to the right MFD and click on transfer to bring up the transfer MFD and we are going to target the moon and 
we are going to press the HTO button. I'm not sure what it uh, stands for, but uh, then again, I would like to take this opportunity to uh, go to the description of this video and download also a tutorial created by David Courtney, if I pronounce it uh, correctly. He has a uh, very good tutorial written uh, about how to get to the moon, also with the Delta Glider. So, uh, yeah, download that as well. And that will really help to understand uh, also what, uh, what you are doing. So, uh, having said that, uh, no intersection. So, what we're going to do is start with the DV plus uh, button. And that's stating about the uh, delta V burn the amount of time that we are going to uh, use the thrusters uh, at uh, yeah, full throttle and as you also will see in the middle of the right hand of the little circle is appearing that is our let's say uh, a flight path We are uh, what we are going to fly. So let's, for example, if this would be uh, it, and we are going to use the yeah, the main engines to throttle only uh, uh, 2,959 seconds. That will bring us over here when we are flying. And what we want, of course, this yellow line over here is the orbit of the moon. This yellow thick line over here is uh, saying something about the position of the moon currently this is our position of course we are flying now here but we'd like to get here not sure if that is correctly by the way <laughs> but let's continue but you will see what I mean oh. And what we would like to do now, because uh, as you can see our yeah, flight path has matched the orbit path of the moon and a grey line appeared and what we would like to do is uh, use the ejection buttons to uh, match the grey line with the yellow dotted line over here. Uh, that 
we are 90 seconds uh, away from uh, from our ejection point. We are nearly there. So and now I'm going to prograde because we are going to perform a prograde uh, burn a little bit. And what we are going to do is when the, this value at the countdown of our uh, injection point reaching uh, 30 seconds left, so to value 30, we are going to start with our prograde burn. So we are, uh, let's say, half a minute uh, away from that uh, injection point. So let's have a quick view outside. We are we flying currently above Australia. Good day, mate. So, all right, four, three, two, one, zero. Uh, so now we are going to start with uh, our burn. This is going to be a long burn. As you can see, the hour, the delta V number is, uh, of course, decreasing. Perfect. All right, so far so good. Well, we can uh, cancel this one, and uh, we are en route to uh, to the moon. So let's have another look outside and fast forward a little bit, so that uh, you and I can see that we are leaving our little beautiful blue planet. And I'm using uh, level 10 textures of uh, the Earth, by the way. And I'm going to fast forward a little bit more. And let's see, we shoot a visual of the moon. Indeed, there we have it. So, uh, let's go back and inside the cockpit, pressing F1 and uh, go to orbit. As you can see the gravitational pull of planet Earth is starting to decrease. And let's go to the left hand of the click orbit. Take as a reference the moon. And as you can see the moon has no influence at us at all at the moment, but that will, uh, yeah start increasing uh, while we getting closer uh, to the moon so let's fast forward a little bit so we can end this tutorial and we will end this tutorial as soon uh, as the moon has some influence 
on our little vessel. Alright. There we have it. Back to normal speed. And uh, I would like to thank you so far for watching. As you can see we are very, uh, well, we are closer to the moon. So uh, thanks for watching so far YouTube. And I uh, hope to see you on part 2 where we are going to perform a uh, mid-correction course burn. And also going into an orbit with the moon itself. So I uh, hope to see you on part 2 on the tutorial to fly to the moon and land on Brighton Beach. Talk to you later. Bye bye.